Hi guys and welcome to the Savvy Professor. In this video I'm going to show you how to add a column in Airtable. So for this simply open your Airtable project. So here is my Airtable project and if I want to add any column in this Airtable simply I will just click on the plus icon here and I will have the option to add any column in this Airtable. And these are the column types that I can add. So basically it's a field and field is basically a column in your table. So for example, if I want to add a new column that is user, I will add it and I will have two options, allow adding multiple users or notify users with base access when they are added. And I will click on create field. After that, I can see here that I've successfully added a new column. Another way to do is simply open your project and go to the main view that is it can be any type of view, grid, form, calendar, gallery or any kind of view. Simply scroll to the right of your project, click on this plus icon and again we have an option to add a column. If I want to add a column that is attachment and if I want to add any description to this column, I will add any description and click on the field name. Here we can also add a name to our column. So for example, if I want to name my column as naming column, I will type in the name and click on create field. After that, we can see here we have successfully created this new column. If you want to add a new row, simply click on this plus icon, type in any data that you want and after that you will have successfully added this new row in your project. And make sure your columns are well organized and they don't go parallel with another column. For example, if I name two columns the same, I will get confused and my project will be at the risk of errors. And also while adding the column, if you want to link to another record, click on that option and select the project and you will have two records. The second one is limit record selection to a view. If you toggle this on, you will have your record selection limited to a specific view and you will also have the option to select that view. For example, I have created these views in my project. I will select any view and this record selection will be limited to this specific market excel view in my case if i have selected this i can choose link to campaigns or choose another options for this column type and i can name my column anything that i want add a description and click on ok and that column will be created in my project so that was basically how you can create a column in airtable like and subscribe if you found this video helpful